Hello, everybody. Welcome back to. Oh our my goodness! I had my now. volume off. That's why. Of course. <laughs> Fucking hell! I'm sorry. God damn it! But yeah. God damn it, Ross! Um, hello, all you aliens and you um, space creatures. Welcome back to another episode of the Irony Show podcast. I'm surprised people are even watching this at this point. Um. Yeah, I apologize if my mic sounds like it's it's uh, coming like it's like it's like my voice is coming out of some um, unspeakable body parts. Let's just say that. But uh, yeah, my other mic broke, so yeah, rip me. Anyways, introduce yourselves, you human beings. Hello! Oh, oh. What? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> and stuff. That's And I fucked this up, I'm sorry. You didn't follow the rules, Darius. It says to go by like turn. It says go individually. Yeah, I thought Yeah, I fucked up. I'm sorry. That was my fault. Don't I claim full responsibility. We'll, we'll, keep, we'll keep it in for a good meme. <laughs> Anyways, yes, introduce yourselves, boys. Sat, you go first. I'm Satirical Joker, that's it. Move along. Hi. Okay, then. Um... Buffy. Wait, wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Alright. Subscribe to Foxy San YouTube. No, don't. Subscribe to Dolan <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'll go, on, I'll go next. Hello, I'm Buffy Chino, an autistic cunt who's terrible at comedy. But then again, who isn't these days? And just like, just like the first, just like the only other person who hasn't introduced himself, my second appearance on the show. Introduce yourself, please. Um, Hello, all you all right. beautiful people out there. I am you, well, your host, Lord Darius. Welcome to the show. You're the co-host, yeah, mate. If anything, you're the beta co-host. <laughs> it's just a word. It's word play. I don't actually mean it. Okay, good. That's what. That is what the social justice warriors say, and so do the liberals. Down with Hillary. We, we are all social justice warriors at some point. <laughs> word play. Tumblr sword and. Uh, Reddit, Reddit Shield. Uh, oh, so I made a buddy of mine quit Reddit. What? I said, sir. Oh, I said this is a legit subreddit called I'm 14, and this is deep. He didn't believe me. He found one, and he's like, I'm quitting Reddit. I no longer Rip. have an account. Ah, uh, hell yeah, boy. Anyways, so if we can go back and find it. the. I have uh, the where, topic where listed right here. Darius has the topics. Darius has the topics. I have the topics right here. Uh, ah, there we go. All right. It's in the topic list. All right. So our first thing on the list: Casey Neistat and Beamy. It's oh, that's actually a pretty good topic. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so basically, kind of what happened was. So CNN bought. So um, CNN bought Beam for like. What, that was like twenty million dollars or something. Yeah, twenty five million. 20, yeah, roughly yeah, twenty to twenty five million. Uh, but yeah, they decided to close it down. Ah, I yeah, they only got in all the information they needed, so they jump and ship. Yeah, honestly, I never really used Beam. I, I, I don't even really care about it, to be honest, but, um... I didn't know this, I didn't know Beam was a thing, until... Neither. I'll be honest, I didn't know what Beam was either. I didn't even know if it existed. But, I will say this, I I don't agree with what CNN did at all. I don't think they should have done it. Like, like close a business down that they just bought for $25 million. They bought it a year ago, just saying. 
Yeah, yeah but still, well, so, that's $25 million lost. One, that's a bad business move. And two, it just shows that television is trying to shut YouTube down at any cost. Yep. Yeah, In all honesty, CNN's made a good business move. Do you want to know why? Why? Casey Neistat, lots of subscribers. People will use the app, and that means they get more. In that means CNN get more information on people. <laughs> Twenty-five million, and you get about what, like one million minimum people's information. That's a good deal. And guess what? They've all done it legally. Yeah, I don't. I'm not saying it's illegal or anything. I just find it a bad business move. You don't see it from a conspiracy theorist side. Yes, I don't. I am a conspiracy theorist in some things, but in others. What do, you about, what do you think about gay frogs? They put chemicals in the, the water that turn the, the friggin' frogs, frogs gay. gay. That's no, say. that's actually a real thing. Wait, what? Yeah. This get oh <laughs> okay well triangulus triangulus in editing this I want you to post the article which I will link to you after this okay all right <laughs> wait, wait so this is a legit thing yeah this is legit it's half oh legit oh my gosh <laughs> what is life you know what else is a legit thing. What? The Canadian national anthem is being altered to be gender neutral. Fuck me. <laughs> yep. They're changing the part of All My Sons Command to All That Us Command. I have only one reason to be proud now. And I know my favorite <laughs> rapper is classified. You, you can be proud of maple syrup. <laughs> <laughs> Now, people, Although we do have Matthew Santoro to be proud of. If you don't, uh, I'm people watching, if you don't get, get this, the joke of Joker is the only person that isn't Canadian in this whole podcast right now. All three of us, the other, the rest of us, me, Naria, Ryan Ellis, we're all Canadian, and we all know. Yeah, here's a thing, though. Life. Here's a thing. Do you know what's hilarious, though? What? Compared to me, you you're all beta British people. <laughs> Pure out of British. Get in there. Jesus, that's worse than one of my burps. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry I didn't get you because of <clears throat> Lord Darius' gross burp. Go on, Joker. <laughs> I'm sorry. I excused myself. Your excuse again, Joker. If you want to continue, triangular. Um, I don't really. I don't really know what else to say, actually, for... Yeah, I wasn't really following the story much either. Do we want to go to the next thing? Uh, uh, let me choose. Let me choose one. Um, yeah, I have nothing else to say really about Beam, because one, I never really followed on something like Casey. Not Here's not something. That, except for that one video that Boyna Fan did about... about <clears throat> That he did about apologizing to him about this track when you're like, <clears throat> and the video makes you think he's apologizing to Rice Gum, but it's actually he's apologizing to Casey Neistat about him mentioning that he doesn't have nice tattoos or nice tats. Nice tats. <laughs> nice ink. Stop it. That's the only thing I followed on by that it that has I'm Michael Jordan. Stop it. it. Get some help. Okay, so you can end in knuckles, I guess. Um, yes. I was about to say, hopefully, this is the last time we have to cover it because it's kind of dying. Dying. Oh, baby. do you know the way, my brothers? Oh Stagon God. Should go and die. Oh God, please don't let that be the next topic. Yes, it is. God damn it! Yeah, <laughs> Fuck so you, God, it knuckles. Apparently, it's racist. <laughs> How is you getting in Knuckles racist? I... Let me. Do, can I explain it? Yeah. Yes, please. Yeah. Okay, it's racist because people are offended that it became a meme, and that and the fact that people are taking lines from uh, a movie, which is racist. But here's the thing, though: the movie producer 
of said racist movie, racist in quotes, has also retweeted Ugandan knuckle memes. It's not racist. People who say it's racist are clearly offended. Millennials, we should go and die in a fire. They shouldn't go die in a fire. They should just go fuck themselves. No, 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 no. no this is what they should do. This is what they should do. This is what they should do. They should go to a Trump we protest, all up and right? execute them. No, they public. should go to a Trump no, protest. No, no. Attempt to interact <laughs> no. with Trump public supporters and then get shot because guess what? Liberals do not like guns. Trump supporters will have AK 47s and AR 15s. They will be shot. Elon okay. Musk flamethrowers. That's not wrong. Well, triangulus. And there's another Elon Musk flamethrower. Yes. Elon Musk flamethrower. Anyway, yep. um, I guess we're done with you getting the knuckles. Uh, what's next here? Logan Paul. Oh, no! Yes. Let me tear this guy a new asshole. Uh, uh, Tide Pod Challenge? What? So we've already talked about the, uh, oh, it's the, Pod the Challenge. beginning of the, uh, Suicide Force situation, but let's talk about the uh, video. The um, like the uh, the, 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 the Good Morning it's America thing. Like he watch, doesn't yeah, care. Wait, what? He was on Good Morning America today. Well, yesterday. He was too. Yeah, and he was making himself a bit of a victim, but that's mostly because just cause they, he pulled a Daddy O Five situation. Yeah, and it was it, not just his fault, it was Good Morning America's fault, because they were just throwing softballs at him. They weren't throwing hard balls. Nope. No, I'm seeing this right now. I'm seeing this right now. What? Get me in a Skype call with Logan Paul. 20 minutes, I can expose the cunt. I would. I don't want you to eat the face off. Actually, yeah, go ahead. No, okay. seriously, get any YouTuber, Onision, hell, I could, hell, I could fucking debate Onision and actually come out on top, do you know why? Why? He tries to discredit people because of certain, like, actions, he, like, he picks out, like, specific char characteristic traits. Yeah. But, like, how he accused on... that one fan of being, that it was his fault that he was suicidal and depressed. Hmm. This thing that I can use this because he tries to discredit people. Oh, you are fucking creating cre 50 million videos on me. What I can use is I can discredit him because he uploads videos where he judges, like, where he judges underage girls. You can discredit him for essentially labeling as a potential pedophile. Yeah. You know what? Fun fact. Well, not really a fun fact, just more of a, just a fact of alternative facts. Yeah. Wow. I actually used to be a, like, not a big fan, but a moderate fan of Onision. Well, oh, but, Jesus. But more of his, like, his, con just really because of his controversial content, because I used to really enjoy, like, kind of, like, satirical, controversial content. Yeah. That was like, when you say controversial, you mean, like, you're in the same cut of cloth as, like, iDubs or something. Yeah, mm, yeah. I never did, like, when you see him. But then he started to be more an asshole than just controversial, and so I just stopped watching him. And then he got yeah. desperate as well. Let's not forget that. Yeah. Yeah. The whole there's a whole leafy rant about him. Yeah. And I remember one time he tried to call out Idubs and Pirate Cynical. I forget what it was for exactly, but oh, oh I know. Wait, hang on. He no, wait. If we're talking about Onision, he called out PewDiePie. Parasynical and Lepius and no, sorry, Le no, yeah, Parasynical, Idubs and PewDiePie for the whole ad apocalypse and saying it's all their fault that there's no more ads. I love how we started this off talking about Logan Paul, but we somehow gone to an easy on. <laughs> <laughs> hey, just <laughs> topics sort of just swing from oh, yeah, to each other, man. Just let it flow naturally. Wait. Yeah. Look on the bright side. Look on the bright side. He's going to make yeah. 50 million videos on us, and guess what? That's more exposure. Oh, hey. oh, yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> but again, he probably wouldn't give a shit about a small YouTube channel like yeah. us. And he does. He does. He does. Two years. We or not two years. We might be. We might be able to actually monetize. I actually don't even really want to monetize this, but yeah. Why not? Wait, how do you expect to pay my ten grand a month salary? <laughs> I'd be charging like five hundred a month. That's basically rent. I would charge. Run, I I run this podcast secretly. Like I am the mastermind. <laughs> <laughs> you are secretly the Illuminati. Two pennies a month, so I can just pay for my cardboard box and I sleep in every night. I have a literal net that... worth of like five dollars and seventy-five cents. I have a net. You have a, your net worth is a small years. loan of a million dollars. I will kill you. That dead as uh. Dead That's as... dead as that body, Logan Paul fan. No, no, no. It's done. It's done. He said it. He said it. None of it. He said it. We're going to get a backlash. It's Darius's fault. Darius's fault. We're going to get backlash. Alright, fair enough. (laughs) You have to go ahead and say that. You have to say it. I'm crying. Uh, I will say I will take at least one <laughs> go ass dumbass for not trying to think of take a break? proper <laughs> Can we possibly proper... take a break right now just to grab all of the help and finish him? <laughs> oh my god, I'm crying! <laughs> right, yeah. 10 minute break. 10 minute break from the calm down. <laughs> not, not while we're, we're um, recording. We, we, we do them when we're streaming. Not recording. Well, we can, just, we can just stop recording, then, <laughs> then start recording again. I would, um, Beta does it okay, when teams are using a good. cigarette. Nah, we can I don't, don't like... want to be like exactly like Beta, so... We're already Ooh. like Beta, for God's sake. We can yeah, pause it, like Game Drops. I don't want to like... Okay, <laughs> I'm, I'm good now. I'm, I'm good. Are you good? Are you good? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Are you sure? <laughs> yes. <laughs> It's just like John Cena rips throat my phone. Are you sure about that? Yeah. <laughs> okay, at least anyway. that was a little bit funny. That was, I will that. That was at least somewhat fun. Whew. Okay, I'm good. This next topic is probably the biggest face palm of the entire internet, besides Logan Paul. Net neutrality? No. The Tide Pod Challenge. Oh man! Yeah, and I have a rant and a half to talk about this. Who? Okay. Go ahead, Buffy. I want, okay, I want, I want to say something first. So, to all the teenagers out there that are stupid enough to follow this, you are you're you're missing a few brain cells if you don't think this is going to kill you. Honestly, like I, I have something to add to that. To the Attention to our fuck faces who want to do something like this. You have no brain. Like literally, your brain fell out of your ear canal just and just ran off because it knew that you were doing something so incredibly stupid and just attention grabbing. Oh quick babe. Yes. No not Go on your rant, puppy. Okay. So and I want to add something more. I asked my sister about this, and she said if she saw any of her friends doing that, she would literally slap the shit out of them. And I agree with her, because if you have the mi- mindset to do something like the Tide Pod Challenge, you're a moron. I'm not taking that lightly. You are an absolute moron. You're just an attention-grabbing piece of shit, and you can go fuck yourself. Can I make a little joke here? What? Natural selection. <laughs> Darwinism. Okay. <sighs> okay, that cheered me up. That cheered me up a little bit. Now I'm done with my rant. I'm good. Okay. So, <sighs> yeah, we, we pretty much got our message can, across there. Can, can I add something to the discussion? Yeah, sure. 
I honestly think we should let Darwinism take its course. If the stupid people want to go eating laundry detergent, have at them. That's less stupid people in the world. <laughs> <laughs> honestly, if the if they do can if they do if they look here's what I'm thinking they do if they have it in their hand and they're like oh it's fine I'll leave it then yeah go through it be an idiot be put in a mental hospital pretty much be an idiot but if you pretty take much. a look at it and you're like I I should not do this power to you you are a smart person you are a Smart and intelligent person, and you can go on with your life. But the people that go like, oh, this is great. You are just going in a circle, just going in a complete loophole of stupid. Just stop. You need As the great Filthy Frank once said, <clears throat> it's time to stop! It's time to stop, okay? No more! Where the fuck are your parents? Who are your parents? I'm going to call Child Protective Services. It's time to stop. <laughs> it's time to stop. But, yeah. But I know there, out of those hundreds and hundreds of dumb attention whores, there are smart people who will go and say, I'm not doing this. I'm better than this. And Apparently I've seen that the donuts... Uh, with icing to make them look like Tide Pods now. Oh. At least those are non toxic. At least those are non toxic. At least those are edible. Which is more cancerous, Tide Pods or fidget spinners? Tide Pods, because Tide Pods can actually fucking kill you. Yeah, good point. You <laughs> I almost thought you just said a midget spinner. A <laughs> 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 midget spinner. It's like a fidget spinner with a time smaller. Let me take this fidget spinner to um to my uh, my uh, butt cheeks real quick. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. <laughs> Okay, this just got dark real quick, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> okay, next topic. 2017 next. it. And by the way, um, if you guys are wondering where it sat when he's kind of using the bathroom. Thank yeah. you for broadcasting that to the entirety of the internet. Well, it's not like he's showing his face, showing his face like Keemstar did to Pyro Cynical. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. just fucking Keemstar. Head. Who's worse, the Pauls of a Keemstar? The Pauls, because, because, well, actually, Keemstar has has does have a bit of a hum, does have Calling a bit people of a because, racial slurs, accusing people of being pedophiles, you know. And, well, but still, um, do any of you remember uh, a YouTuber known as the Angry Grandpa? Oh uh, yeah, yeah, rest in peace. Um, yeah, recently, uh, Keemstar actually went to his funeral, which is either attention-grabbing, or is actually showing a bit of humanity. Or a bit of uh, both. I think it's more attention-grabbing than his humanity. Honestly, he has none. Keemstar has been... I, I'd say Keemstar has been trying to redeem himself a bit. A bit. Not... not There's really no bit, redeeming DJ Keemstar, And also, man. at least he has a bit of a brain to know that even the Paul brothers are idiots. Oh, he's called the Pauls, idiot. Yeah. Like, just, just you know, you guys are like, you know, you're an idiot when Keemstar is calling you an idiot. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and he's like the king of douchebags. Yeah. And he's like, for a while, he was like one of the dumbest people on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, no even Lord. Yeah, but even he called the Paul brothers, like, douchebags. So, yeah. yeah. Newsflash, douchebag. And, and this, is, this is the same guy who, uh... Uh, I ain't saying I ain't saying because, well, if we ever decide Say to it. monetize this, um, there goes the monetization. We're not even part of the partner program, so who cares? 
when I'll make yeah, you know, yeah the new partner YouTube. program was put in place today we need like a thousand subscribers like some uh a whole uh, fucking lifetime views Wait, today yeah not they're, today. they're implementing a new yeah, partnership program that, that was like a week or two ago dude yeah oh I am so fucking slow oh uh, no one's really I'm as slow as a goddamn like snail ever. I can actually as slow as a snail. We just got so off topic. <laughs> um, yeah, that's an off topic question. Yeah, but at least it, it but at least that that uh, what was I gonna say? It adds I'm some production. Trying to make a Chris Christie yeah, reference, but you know. At least at I least can say this right now. Um, this is on a public server, um, but one of our podcast members is saying that the world should be nuked. Um. um... Oh yeah, uh, speaking of being nuked, the doomsday clock, everybody! Yay! Oh, great! South Africa running out of water in the next few months! Woohoo! Oh! Um, <gasps> you know the only reason it's two minutes to midnight because of North Korea. Two and a half and minutes, USA. actually? Yep. No, it's, it's two minutes. The reason why we die. I just thought of the Iron Maiden song, Two Minutes to Midnight. Oh, such a good song. Here's the thing, though, with North Korea talking to South Korea, that's good. The Olympics, a... yeah. Because yeah. oh, speaking of the US? Olympics, can I say something right quick? Okay. Yeah, for, so like the beginning of the Olympic relay to go to the main city where the Olympics is going to be held, right? The first team to carry the Olympic torch was an esports team from South Korea. Oh yeah, I heard about that. Like, uh, wait, what? Yeah, it was like, yeah. Um, like, yes. uh, finally, gaming is getting into the Olympics. No, but oh, their yeah. team is going to be carrying the torch. Yeah, like, yeah, the team is carrying the the Olympic relay torch. I meant like it's slow. Esports will be part of the Olympics one day. Gaming better become part of the Olympics soon, or else. I'm League of Legends and Dota. It'd be the only reason why I would even watch the Olympics in the first place. <laughs> I mean, I watch the Olympic gold medal hockey game every year, but you know. Uh, yeah. Fair enough. We are Canadian, after all. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, hockey's kind of in our blood. Mm -hmm. In our blood. And Same with Tim's. And veins. Yeah. We got this feeling inside our bones. I I God damn it. <laughs> this has got... Really cringy all of a sudden. Yeah, you no. got that sunshine in your pocket. Neither of you can sing, like... I know I can't sing. Uh, you should be our vocalist I if you can sing better. To see Run to the hills. Okay, can we, can we kind of... Can you <laughs> all, like, just go and suck on, like, the biggest cock ever? I <laughs> the biggest horse dick. I would, but Logan Paul is nowhere to be seen where I am right now. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That was genuinely funny, Buffy. I'll give you that one. You've right. now been upgraded to Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Okay, I'm not that. Not, not that one. <laughs> uh, uh, right. Net neutrality updates. Oh Jesus! It's a G Paul. <laughs> oh, that oh, meme. Spicy, spicy <laughs> meme from last episode. <laughs> Very spicy. You know, it's another thing we could probably talk about. Um, the thing we're gonna talk huh. about now. <laughs> yeah. You're fucking net neutrality. I was gonna Get say. Down. So, I was gonna uh, say Trump stay addressed to the union, but you know. No. Yeah, um, Canada is actually doing something about the doing something because of the net neutrality, like this whole uh, anti-piracy internet uh, thing going on in Canada. Yeah, we should pr we should probably talk about Trump's State of the Union address too. But wait, I want to add something to the net neutrality thing. Yep. Um, so, uh, so, this is just a bit off topic, but you know how in, um, South Park now, recently now, 
Mr. Garrison is um, Donald Trump of South Park, right? Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. no. Because I haven't watched South Park, really, but... The I've PP never watched principal. South Park. Yeah, well, see, what... Now with the whole net neutrality thing, what would, it, what would happen, like, next season? What would we see, like, Ajit Pai sucking on fucking... <clears throat> fucking... Logan <clears throat> Paul's dick. Uh, no, Mr. Garrison's not, dick. Not Logan Paul, boy. <laughs> Logan Paul has nothing to do with this. Will we see, <laughs> will we see like, Ajit Pai sucking on Mr. Garrison's dick now that he's the president of the United States? Oh, and hell. No, he'd be sucking on the dicks of both Comcast and AT&T. <laughs> fair, fair enough. And Verizon, because, well... And Sprint. He, he was actually an employee of Verizon, so... Yeah. Time Warner. I uh, don't really know about them, but... Well, they're a branch of AT&T, so you know. Oh, yeah, that's right, ain't it? Yep, Universal. <laughs> I'm just not saying anything because I know for a fact it will be reported if I open my mouth on this. Oh. <laughs> what? Well, How about we just get to the next topic because the last topic before this, I I was getting very depressed because of Doomsday and shit. So, yeah. next topic, please. Hold on. <laughs> what? Um, have you guys seen the... the that, um... That uh, Burger King net neutrality video. Yeah, oh, yep, we it, saw it that. is beautiful. That. Oh, it is beautiful. The, I, I saw something from Nerdist News the other day. From what? God damn. Oh, my, my, oh, my computer just Super like, Mario oh. Brothers the movie. I what? I heard about that like a month ago. Please don't tell me they're making another one. I Yeah, from what I've heard, they're making another one. Oh, the last one sucked so hard. Apparently it's going to be from the same guys as freaking Minions. Oh, Jesus, oh, no. We're screwed. Yeah. We're... Oh, Nintendo. First Nintendo, you lied to us. Come on. Just end my life, please. Um, what about Black Panther? That's coming out pretty soon. Yes. Oh, well, that's fucking yes. Marvel. It's going to be awesome. Yes, Black Panther. I'm going oh, to say that in two weeks. Uh, is it two weeks? I have no idea, but what I'm most excited for is Ant-Man and the Wasp. Oh, yes. I that looks amazing. Yeah. Um, oh, here's something topical. As of September, you're going to have to start paying these the internet on your Switch. Oh, fucking hell. Nintendo. Yep. You are not EA. <laughs> you are not Microsoft. You are not Sony or Xbox Live. You, you should be more like Steam, if anything. Yeah, like, what the hell? Is it... I Hopefully this is not the same for the 3DS, usually, because I'd be some fucking pissed. My 3DS is, like, dead, basically. I still have my... D I still have my DS right here, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I still play Pokemon White version on here. <laughs> The most racist I'm not right. Who the fuck would put on white version? I don't even have a regular DS. I have a DSi. Oh, <laughs> yeah, um, so do I. I, I funny thing about, um, what, about video game movies. Um, I was actually thinking about something like a month ago. Um, how would another attempt? at a Doom movie from guys who actually like and play the Doom series sound. That would actually be good, I think. Yeah. That yeah. actually sounds Now, better. here's a question for you guys. What? Who would win? Darth Vader or Xenomorph? Darth Vader. If this was fighting at a distance, then yeah, I'd say Darth Vader. No, he'd win either way, I'd say. Yeah. Lights, lightsabers wouldn't be enough, because you know how acidic Xenomorph's blood is? Yeah, but still... Like, so it'd dissolve, like, everything as soon as he cleaved into it. Hold on, why didn't this become, like, a high school, like, high school nerdy debate? I know we're nerds, but still, we got we gotta be professional about this shit. Well, we are, still. <laughs> well, we're angry video game nerds. 
trying her best. We're angry video game nerds, guys. No, there's only one one angry video game nerd, and that's James Walton. Get that right, bitch. <laughs> I'm not a bitch. I'm not your sister. Oh. Fuck you! <laughs> what? Fuck you! Okay. No, I had someone to do that for me. Oh. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna kick you right now. I'm gonna no. kick you. Uh, actually, yeah. Oh, come on, where's a little humor now and then? You're talking about my sister, you cuck. <laughs> I'm not rice gum. What the fuck? <laughs> hold on, hold on, Buffy. I, I got you here. Hold on. Okay. What? What are you doing to me? <laughs> <laughs> That's what get you, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I moved you. <laughs> Why? That's what you get, bitch. I made one out of context joke. I I'm now PewDiePie. PewDiePie. I... But you don't understand. It was, it was something very. I'm just gonna be a dick about this. Non advertising. Yeah, I know. I didn't think before I said what I said. I know. I apologize. Okay. Thank you. I'll accept that. I, I, that's the thing about me, I t generally don't tend to think about what I'm going to say. Um, I this is that, me. I've known that for, like, mo for most of the time that I've known you. We've known each other for about five years now. Like, you should know this. No, it wasn't about five years, it'd be about seven years now, I think. Yeah, it'll be seven years in the fall that we've known each other. Holy fuck, we've really known each other seven years? Yeah. Jesus Christ, it doesn't feel that long. <laughs> time flies when you want to die. Oh, time flies when you want to die, huh? What? Again, I am reverting back to my crappy comedy. That doesn't even make any sense. Take on me. Well, Mine diamond because probably just in awe of what he's hearing. Mine diamond. Ah. No, apparently Seth's uh, leaving for now. So okay, yeah. goodbye, Seth. Understandable because we're all being cunts right now. We might. As, uh, did we actually cover everything? Yeah, we covered everything. Alright, so we might as well end it here then. If that's the case. Um, Alright. Hope well. you guys enjoyed this shit show. Uh, drop a like if you did. Mm -hmm. That would be lovely because YouTube likes to uh, screw over small creators. Yep. And, and... all remember, you're lovable, but we're not. Stay awesome.